Hi, I'm Steve Ernst, editor of Lab Compare, and I'm talking with Pat Magai, president of Canon Instrument Company, about the CAV 4.2 automatic dual bath discometer. Pat, this is an ASTM D445 instrument. Steve, that's correct. Uh, this is the most advanced fully automated viscometer that Canon has produced, and we've been producing automated viscometers since 1972. This instrument uh, culminates in the most advanced technologies that we've been able to develop for both sensing the uh, timing, controlling the temperature of the sample, and automating the entire process. What does standalone mean for the CAV 4.2? The CAB 4.2 has an integrated computer with a color touchscreen system, uh, very fluid, similar to an Android type interface, but the system allows fully unattended operation without a standalone PC. But because of the modular architecture, we can control up to four of these systems connected to a PC software system known as VisPro that offers the ability for LIMS output capability. What key features of the 4.2 improve system efficiency? So one of the technologies that's unique to Canon is the use of a smart thermal meniscus sensing system. So the tubes themselves detect the liquid using a thermal property as opposed to an optical property. And as a consequence, the sample can be either water white or carbon black. The opacity or transparency of that sample is not critical to the performance. Can you tell me more about the washing and drying features? So the system integrates fully automated tube washing and drying, which affords up to three solvents per tube. So a total of six solvents can be plumbed to the CAB 4.2 and then selected based on the sample type that is being run. And because of the system architecture, we have the ability to select multiple test methods and mix those multiple sample types on a single tray. So for example, if you were running base oil and you wanted to simply use heptane as a wash solvent, but then switch over to running a petroleum wax, which may require the use of toluene first, followed by heptane, you have the ability to program that in to the system as a test method, specific, and then run multiple different sample types on a given tray. Each system comes with a 14 position automated sample changer, and both systems operate independent of one another. So while this bath is measuring, this bath can be set up and configured, and they run independent. With dual baths, we have the ability to run two separate temperatures, or two temperatures at the same time. And this system can operate at any temperature between 15 and 150 degrees C. What's the range of viscosities that can be measured? So we employ a compound Ubelodi style viscometer tube that allows up to a hundred fold range and with a calibration extension we can go to 300 fold range on each tube. We have the ability to measure viscosities as low as 0.3 centistokes and as high as 10,000 centistokes. The system comes with integrated solvent system heating and waste heating. So all of the waste stream can be heated from the sample tip to the waste container. So when running difficult samples like petroleum waxes, or very high viscosity additives or base oils, we have the ability with that heat to reduce the viscosity to ensure that the waste makes its way from the system to the train without backing up. Does the system itself help with solvent usage? It does. Because of the small capillary size in this viscometer, we use roughly a quarter of the solvent that was required on our previous generation systems. So the solvent usage of the system would directly translate into a savings for the lab from an operation standpoint, not only on the consumption but on the disposal side. How easy is it to run a sample? Steve, it's very simple. So based on the display here, we have the left sample changer and the right sample changer. But to enter a sample ID, you just simply pick the position and you type in the sample ID. Now on this particular system, we have it set to a default test method. Had we not had it set to a default test method, before I entered the sample ID, the system would have asked me what sample type, whether it be a base oil, petroleum wax, an additive, a formulated oil. After that, you would enter in the sample ID. Once you've entered your sample IDs, you simply hit the play button and the system begins the sample automation and testing. 
I know ease of use has become a critical feature in many laboratories today with things being more technical and higher test volumes uh, expanded. Are there any other significant features here that add to that? From a serviceability standpoint, the system is extremely modular and we'll talk about how this system actually opens up. It's a bit like a transformer. The tray opens up, uh, the electronics come up and the baths are removable, all while the system is operating. So you do not need to turn it off to do system maintenance. The entire system is operating on DC power, so there are no electrical shock hazards on it. And because we can work on the system hot, we can do calibrations, we can do cleanings, while the other bath is continuing to operate. Thank you, Pat. The CAV 4.2 sounds like a great advance in viscosity measurement. Thank you, Steve. Uh, we're pretty excited about this instrument. Our customers are as well. But for those that are interested in more information, please go to caninstrument.com. Thank you.